Hello everyone and welcome back. Actually, hang on, we're just gonna fix this up a bit. There we go. All right, so we're a lot better. Uh, like I said, hello everyone, welcome back. We have a box break video of the new 1819 SP Authentic for you guys. Yeah, SPA, best time of the year. Well, apart from series one and two in my opinion, but you know. It's also series one and two, so yeah. So let's get right into it. Obviously, we're chasing the Future Watch Auto Auto Rookie cards. Um, maybe a Jack Eichel Auto which would be deadly. Uh, personally, I want the Cock and Niemi Future Watch Auto Rookie card. Hopefully, but if we get like Pedersen or something, I'll be happy. Still, of course, it all. Sorry, just fixing myself there. No, Justin. Of course, we have the um, sign of the time decades, which would be cool. And all that. Of course, Nico Hischer and all that has Future Watch Auto rookie cards, so I don't think there are true rookie cards. I don't know. I'll have to check the back of them, because if the Hischer says Hischer, DeBrus, Kunin, and Nikas say 2019 in the back, they're not true rookie cards, just like the Jack Eichel. Not a true rookie card. Because again, 2019. Someone started to sell one on eBay as true rookie. No, it isn't. Alright. So we're gonna start with the right side. Because from what I've been seeing for these boxes, the future wash half it on the left side. So yeah. So here you are, here are the packs. And let's jump right into it. Of course, if I get a future wash auto and all that, we're gonna save it for last. You know, so Start off with Jonathan Duran Common. These are the comments this year. Again, always nice looking from SPA. There is the back. You can never go wrong SPA comments. We also have Alex Touch. We have our first insert, which is a Victor Rask. Upper deck update common. With the Minnesota Wild when he's part of that um, trade with the um, Minnesota Wild. as landed uh, Neil Niederreiter there to Carolina. Decoy. Or a blocker, as I like to call them. We also have Evgeny Malkin and Leon Dreisel. Also, there are the Upper Deck Update sets in here. Like, the Commons. There's only 8 Young Guns this year, which is weird. Because usually there's 10 Young Guns. This year there's only 8. They have, you know, Acetate cards in them. The Acetate Future Wash cards, which is also cool. They also have, like, the 99-2000 SP Authentic insert. Which is, like, the Draft Day cards or something. Making sure this is in the auto, okay. Yep, Jake Gunsell. Yeah, they have like the 99-2000 retro-looking cards, or like draft day cards, whatever. Something like that, some insert like that. Anyways, Evgeny Kuznets off. We have a authentic moments of Marc-Andre Fleury. This is for Flower Moose at 10th on NHL career wins list. So that's pretty cool. I do want the uh, Vegas Golden Knights one of like the entire team when they're like going to the Stanley Cup Finals, because that would be cool. We also have Colt Preco and Eric Stahl. But yeah, of course, Rookie Year Milestones are back again. Oh, yeah, actually. Well, I'll put it with the inserts. But they're not really considered inserts because they're, like, you know, part of the base set with the numbering. But throw with the inserts. But yeah. Jimmy Yarns. Okay, we have a red parallel. Okay, we have Connor Hellebuck. Connor McDavid. Red parallel of Blake Wheeler. And our last two commons are of Steven Stamkos and Sidney Crosby. Also keep an eye out for the auto patch because there's like one in inner or something like that. And you know, I don't really want to hit that. Authentic moments are cool. So we have Taylor Hall. Zach Hyman. We have authentic moments of Roberto Luongo. And it's Louis makes 1,000th NHL appearance. Luongo could go down as one of the greatest goalies ever to not win the Stanley Cup. Which will be a sad thing. We have Jonathan Quick. And Thomas Hurdle. That's our last two commons. Next pack. Yeah, I think there's one more pack on the right side. And that's done that row. Alright. Of 
We have our young guns. So we have Vladimir Tarasenko, Patrick Kornkos, and we have Josh Mahura Young Guns for the Anaheim Ducks. So that's cool. So that's one of eight for me that I need. Anthony Mantha and Jack Eichel, which for whatever reason, Upper Deck has not updated this picture of Jack Eichel yet. I don't know why they're still using 1819's pictures for him. When right now he's number nine and the captain. Uh, I was about to say something too about the young guns. Oh yeah, interesting fact of the young guns. Card 519 was Tom or Tim Gettinger for the New York Rangers. That's no longer the case. Apparently 519 is now Colin Delia of the Chicago Blackhawks. So why the change? I don't know. But it doesn't matter to me. Still young guns. Alright. So we have Matt Sugarello. Roberto Luongo. We have an upper deck update of Carl Hagelin. Blocker. Ooh, we actually got a future watch rookie card too. Not auto, but we have Jake Bean of 999 for the Carolina Hurricanes. Probably one of the top two future watch. No, 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 wait. Never mind. I'm thinking of Young Guns. Yeah, no, he's one of the, you know, few non auto. I think there's like 19 non auto future watches this year, so he's one of them. Can't go wrong with that. And Mark Stones are calling. Honestly, was not expecting that to be there. Yeah, some of those they throw behind the blocker, which is quite weird. Alright, first pack, middle row. Authentic moments and comments. Alright, cool. Alright, so we have Ricard Raquel. Mac andre Fleury. So we have authentic moments of Brock Besser. And is Brock Besser named MVP of NHL All-Star Game? So there we go with that. Locker, and then we have John the Taves and Kevin Schattenkirk. All right, next pack. Again, fun stuff. Always love opening SPA. It's also one of those products that I recommend doing a box instead of doing by pack, unless you're extremely lucky. Yeah. All right, so we have Jonathan Marchessault, Aaron Ekblad. We have a red parallel of Braden Shen. Tom Wilson and Clayton Keller. Some of the packs correlations I've noticed have not been good for common wise. Like I've seen a few boxes and stuff broken up and so far some of these commons have been like the same in some of these packs. Like for example, if we get a peck of red in the back. Which is this Greg Anderson? I guarantee there'll probably be an Anze Kopitar. All right, what do we have here? Rookie Year Milestones. All right, so cool. So we have Carey Price, Brian Marchand. We have our first Rookie Year Milestones of John Klingberg. Klingberg tops rookie blue liners with 40 points. So I don't know how many are in this set, but again, I am doing this year's set too. I'm also trying to finish off last year's set, so I'm definitely keeping that. Blocker. We have James Van Riemsdyk and Craig Anderson. So, third last pack in the middle row. I'm also trying to keep the eye outside. Again, red parallel and comments. All right, cool. So, Blake Wheeler, John Tavares. And I've seen this happen. This would be my personal first, but I've seen it happen twice. A red parallels of John Tavares. So yeah, very weird because I've seen a pack that had Austin Matthews common, then an Austin Matthews red parallel, then again with another player, or then his red parallel right behind it. So very weird, but still fun, I guess. I don't know. Weird correlation, I guess. Anyways, we have Brock Brock Besser and Andre Vasilevsky. So by the look of it, our auto hits are gonna be in the um all the left side, which is why, one of the reasons why I'm starting from the right. Authentic moments and comments. All right, cool. So we have Toivo Teravainen. Mitch Marner, who may or may not be a leave next year, depending on, you know, if the least can afford him. We have a nice Rasmus Dalin authentic moments. If Dalin goes first in 2018 initial draft. Actually, I had to double check that one. So there you go. Pretty cool. Our 
last two commons are Justin Williams and Cam Talbot. Last pack in the middle. Again, I keep checking for an auto patch too. Because again, that'd be cool, but okay, upper deck. Okay, cool. We're good. We have an upper deck update card. So we have Sergey Bobrovsky, Alex Kerfoot. We have an update of a Brendan Perlini for the Chicago Blackhawks. Blocker. We have Jake DeBrusque and Will Butcher. All right, so final roll. Auto time. So we should get our two autos here. Maybe a third if we're lucky. All right, so we do have one of those draft update cards or draft cards. We have Alex Ovechkin. Mikhail Granlund. And our draft card is actually a really good one. We have Sidney Crosby. Draft. Rookie draft. Retro draft or whatever it is. RDP. Again, I can't remember what it's called. But either way, this is the 99-2000 SP Authentic card look. So, yeah. Very cool card. Especially with Crosby. Cannot go wrong with him. We also have the Dominator and Jerome and Ginla. Still waiting on our first autograph. Plot twist. We get zero. I would honestly cry. We have our SPX Spectrum card here. Sean Monahan. Miko Rantanen. Blocker. We have, unfortunately, Pekka Rene. I was hoping for Anze Kopitar for the collection. But still, Pekka Rene. So cool. Upper Deck Bounty Program. Eric Carlson and Matt Barzell. So we have four packs left. So two autographs, one Future Wash Spectrum card, and maybe a bonus auto. Who knows? We're going to find out, though. All right. This is... Uh, okay, we got our Future Wash Spectrum. So we have... Max Domi, Flip Forsberg, and we have, ooh, level two, Dennis Cholowski. He's actually a really good defenseman, really good prospect. We finish off with John Carlson and Ryan O'Reilly as our base guard, so three packs left. This is our authentic autograph, and unfortunately, I already saw the team. So I know who the Future Watch is, maybe, actually. I, well, I know the team of the Future Watch auto, but I don't know the player this is. We do also have a limited auto. It's green, so I'm also not looking too forward to that. So we'll try and go for this pack. And we have another rookie year. Okay, so we can do this one. So we have Matt Duchesne, Braden Shen. We have rookie year milestones of Sidney Crosby. Crosby tops Penguins with five game winning goals as a rookie. So that's cool. Definitely a Crosby box. Again, I've seen... It's weird because I've seen a box with the exact same rookie year milestones with that Crosby draft day thing. So that's weird. Anyways, we have Guy Lafleur and William Carlson. So, unfortunately, I don't think we have a big hit, but we do have our auto. So, first watch, so we'll go with Evander Kane, Anders Lee, and our limited auto is of Eric Stahl for the Minnesota Wild. So, this is actually probably going to get traded into my local card store since, you know, Eric Stahl is local. Blocker, we have Pierre-Luc Dubois. And Johnny Gaudreau. And let's get our last auto out of the way. Austin Matthews. Nico Hischer. Unfortunately, I picked the wrong box. And our autograph is of Dylan Sakura. For the Chicago Blackhawks. 240 out of 999. Unfortunately, we did not get a big autograph. Unfortunately, it's just probably like your average box of SPA. Bo Horvat and our Timmy Panarin we're finishing off with. So, overall, average box. Nothing too big to write home about, which is sad because, you know, 
I'm seeing people of all these amazing hits, and we're getting stuck with Brennan Perlini Commons. But that's all for now. This is basically SPA summed up. Again, this is what most boxes you're going to find are going to be like, you know. Unfortunately, we didn't get anything, you know, signing the times I wanted because there are a few Habs autos I got, but. At least we did get a Future Watch Auto Rookie here that I do have on my wish list. I think. Should be. But either way, thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you all next time. Take care.